Alright. So, today I am going to go meet my old drama school teacher for a pint because I miss him. I haven't seen him in like three months. And he was one of my favourite people ever. But I was thinking, just walking back there, that um, a lot of my songs uh, that are on YouTube are of just me sort of playing my piano. And there's maybe like three or four mu. I think there's four music videos and the rest are just me playing my piano, bashing out songs. And it occurred to me that a lot of my, at least two of my music videos I'm not happy with. So, what I'm going to do is um, re-record the, the two music videos I'm not happy with. I'm going to re-record the songs as well. Uh, because they're not... I mean, Indifference was okay produced in terms of music, because um, I had help from Steve, but I need to sort of take that and make it better. I'm not entirely sure how I'm, I'll work it out, but it needs to sound better, and I've added another verse, so that needs to, to change. Uh, and also, No Inspiration, which was the first music video I ever produced. And yet, <coughs> hmm, that wasn't great either. I mean, at the time I was sort of happy with it. I was like, yeah, it's, it's really good. But I've watched it back a few times and thought, oh, I think as a aspiring musician, producer and director, um, I, I keep wanting to better myself. I mean, there's a part of me that re really just wants to redo Taken as well. Um, but Taken's not too bad. I need to... Yeah, it needs work. But as a, a musician, producer and director, I just want to keep bettering myself. And the only way I can see to better myself is by creating or re-recording some mu like music to the best of its ability. Because that, I feel, is is like fundamental in being a good musician is looking at old work that you are still proud of I'm still proud of all of my videos uh, and then recreating them but also I'm gonna actually produce my album now which I've been talking about doing for about a year now which <laughs> I keep saying yeah I'm gonna gonna make an album yeah but I haven't I've got the songs for an album, but I haven't actually made it. So, yeah, when I go back to Canterbury, I'm going to spend, I would say a week in the studio, but the studio is currently my bedroom. Uh, and I'm just going to record everything. I'm going to lay it all down. And then I'm going to convert it into, or do what I need to do with it, make it sound as good as it can be. And then I'm going to put it on probably my band camp because I don't have an iTunes merchant account thing which is actually proven quite difficult to get hold of because if they don't think it's good enough they won't put it up which I think is really really annoying but yeah so plans I did say that was one of my new year's resolutions to finish my album which I haven't for all intents and purposes finished I've got something like 14 songs Talking of songs, I'm going to be making a new song as well when I go back to Canterbury about zombies. I've sort of wanted to write a zombie song for a while and I might, I don't know whether it's going to be on my solo album or part of my band. I think it might be part of my band because I want a sort of pop punk feel to it and I can't just do that on piano. So yeah, oh, this one's actually turned out to be quite a long one compared to my others so yeah things to take away from this video gonna re-record no inspiration and indifference and reproduce them um, always want to better myself as a musician gonna record my album uh, gonna go up on my van camp so, so yeah that's what I'm gonna do all right so I move the dirty guys